Hey, I missed being here with you last week. Uh, Tammy and I were up in Indianapolis visiting Mark and Tara Caswell and their boys, uh, Hudson and Jack. We had a great time with them at Legacy Stone Church there in Indianapolis. Uh, they're about uh, 18 months or so into their church plant there, and uh, things are going great, but I want you to be sure and pray for Mark and Tara and all of our other church planners. You know, starting churches is tough work, especially when you go into a place uh, like Indianapolis where uh, church is not uh, like it is here in the Bible Belt. And they're starting from scratch, and uh, there's encouraging times, and uh, there's also some discouraging times. So just pray for them and pray for Legacy Stone Church that they will continue to see God do great things. There were three new families uh, that were there uh, yesterday yesterday, uh, all right, last Sunday when we were there with them, so it was a great time and uh, we enjoyed being there. But I'm looking forward to being back this Sunday in the pulpit, a brand new sermon series and I'm calling uh, Joshua Tearing Down the Walls. Now, this is not really a series about Joshua himself so much, it's more about the Israelites and the Battle of Jericho. You know, that was a seven day battle uh, that the Israelites had. Uh, with the people of Jericho. Uh, but the Israelites didn't really have to do any battle because God did the battle for them. Now in that battle we find seven principles for dealing with difficulties in our lives. So that's what we're going to deal with in this series. Each week we'll take one uh, thing that will help us to overcome difficulties and, uh, and problems in our life. Uh, we all have them. Uh, everybody has difficulties. And so th coming this Sunday, we're going to talk about how do we deal with those. And we're going to do that by looking at uh, Jericho and all that took place there. It's an amazing story. And uh, I know you're going to enjoy going through this with us. And uh, most importantly, finding some things that will help you as you deal with difficulties in your life. I want to tell you about something happening next Thursday. Thursday, November the 12th, I think it is. Uh, that day, uh, we're going to be a part of the rebuilding of Eureka Park at South Lakes Park here in Denton. Uh, some of you might remember 20 something years ago when that park was first built. Uh, they've torn it down and they're redoing the whole thing. And from uh, five to eight o'clock that night, we've uh, kind of put in our name, First Baptist Church, to supply as many people as we can to help with that rebuilding. And I'm gonna be there and some of our other staff members are gonna be there. So I just wanna encourage you to think about it. You need to go online. Uh, you can go online to the Denton Parks and Recreation site, I think, and sign up, put your name in there to be a part of it. And then come Thursday at five o'clock and we'll be there till eight o'clock helping to rebuild that playground so that children for years to come can have a safe place to play and a fun place to play. And uh, we can have a part in, uh, in serving our community to be a part of that as well. So that's on Thursday, November the 12th. So I hope you'll think about being a part of that. Uh, it's a great time of year. You know, the weather's getting a little cooler. We're getting close to the holidays. I uh, look forward to seeing you every Sunday here at First Baptist Church to worship with us and to study God's word and to see all that God's gonna do in our church this fall.